It starts with a whistle and ends with a gun. 60 minutes of close in action from kickoff to touchdown. This is pro football, the sport of our time. 11 trained men face to face on the field of play. Each man a specialist, but one man stands above the rest. He occupies the most critical position in the game. He is the quarterback. He blocks, directs, and executes the on-field fortunes of his team. The quarterback lives in a world of pressure. How well he lives with it and reacts to it determines how good he is. He must have a cool disregard for danger and the courage to take punishment. quarterback has two formidable allies. One is deception. By clever faking, he can confuse the defense and open a clear path for the play. His second ally is the forward pass. It's a long bomb. A screen pass over charging linemen. A bullet from the midst of a traffic jam. The pass in the hands of a pro quarterback is a bolt of lightning that can strike anywhere, anytime. Each quarterback in the NFL has his own particular style. or just drop back 20 or 30 yards before he makes up his mind. Second only in importance to the mind and arm of the quarterback, is the instinct and legs of the runners. He's an attack all by himself, a spinning, dancing dervish. speed and breakaway ability. Every team in the NFL that boasts a balanced attack has a phantom flyer in its lineup. The power gear in the offensive machine is the fullback. Jim Taylor, number 31, is a fullback, and this is the way of fullbacks. Quickness, an asset. The approach is not subtle. The yards he gains, the toughest. are the runners. 
the racehorse halfbacks and locomotive fullbacks. Theirs is the speed and the fury, and to them must go the glory. This yard of space is called no man's land. Football games are won or lost by control of this narrow strip of land. The battle for it is a violent one. The hands of combat. The hands of pros. is the part of the game rarely seen by the spectator. The shattering impact of a block. The mountainous size of an onrushing defender. The splintering force of a far-arm shiver. One ton of muscle with a one-track mind. Down in the dirt, the lair of the lineman. This is where the game is played. The fringe of no man's land is patrolled by the linebackers. The search and destroy men of the defense. Number 50, search and destroy. Number 58, search and destroy. Sunday after Sunday, pro quarterbacks have learned that whatever play they call, a linebacker is likely to meet it head on. This is the face of the tiger. And this, the action of the tiger. Linebackers provide the defense with enormous flexibility. They can charge through the line into the enemy backfield or slide laterally against plays to the outside. Roving far from the ruck of the scrimmage line is the pass receiver. His range carries him into heavy traffic. Or through the shifting dangers of a broken field. The pass catches of pro football's men on the run. Measuring their survival by the twist of a shoulder. head fake, the burning speed that cuts them free. The philosophy of successful pass receiving is simple. Be alone when the ball arrives. But with a big tight end like John Mackey, number 88, it doesn't make any difference. and disciplined patterns of Raymond Berry, number 82, have made him the most proficient pass catcher in history. The rapport that exists between a gifted passer and his favorite receiver is part instinct, part practice, and part luck. the moves, the 
grace and a willing disregard for the consequences. Opposing the receiver is the defensive back. One man alone facing another man alone. A man whose skill and wits he knows and fears but must cancel. His directive, stop the play. Guess and gamble but don't fail. They're the last line of the defense. They pick up the pieces that the line and linebackers let through. For the defensive back, the glory is great. Or the disgrace, absolute. For others, there is anger, despair, exultation, moments of emotion that pierce the frenzy of play to reveal the man behind the uniform. A call, the ball is snapped and the play continues. A drum of man on man in a race against the clock. It's precision, persistence, power. The unleashed speed of the kickoff, the whistling feet of a great runner, the reckless fury of a goal line stand, the crowning glory of a winning touchdown, the swelling roar of the crowd. It's called Pro Football. <laughs> 